Now let me tell you how to uh, improve your ear, how to use different exercises to be able to hear and identify different triad types that we've talked about in this session. So first of all, let's review intervals. You probably all know what intervals are. There are two kinds of intervals. Melodic intervals is a distance between two melodic pitches. That's your melodic interval. And the harmonic interval are intervals are two simultaneously sounding pitches. Right? Uh, intervals are defined by their quality. We can have major intervals, minor intervals, perfect intervals, diminished intervals, augmented, double augmented, double diminished, and so forth. So on the board, you can see uh, basic intervals. Perfect unison is the distance between two notes of the same uh, name, C to C, that's your perfect unison. And as far as uh, alterations of the unison, we can have diminished unisons and augmented unisons. Major second has two semitones, is the dis distance between two uh, C and D, for instance, two semitones. Minor second is the distance of a one semitone, C to D flat. Notice that we label major seconds uh, C to D flat, not C to C sharp, because major second uses two different letter names for the notes. C to C sharp would have been augmented unison, because it uses the same letter name. So C to D is a, ma a minor second, uh, D flat is a minor second. Major thirds, uh, C to E, four uh, semitones, minor third, C to E flat, three semitones, Perfect fourth, five semitones, F, C to F, augmented fourth, C to F sharp, perfect fifth, C to G, diminished fifth, C to G flat. Notice the difference in spelling. C to F sharp is the augmented fourth because the distance between C and F is a fourth, and then we raised F sharp to get to augmented fourth. C to F sharp is also known as a triton, has six, six semitones, and it subdivides the octave into two equal parts. So it's a very important, strategically important interval, the triton. And the diminished fifth is labeled C to G flat, because first we get five, uh, the fifth from C to G, and then we lower G flat to get the diminished fifth. Major six, C to A has nine semitones, and uh, minor six has uh, eight semitones, C to A flat. Major seven has 11 semitones, C to B, and C to B flat has 10 semitones, and perfect octave. So these are simple intervals, and of course we can have compound intervals, intervals that exceed an octave. So for instance, C to D octave higher is an uh, octave plus a major second or a nine. Right. So let me play these intervals on the piano so you can hear the quality. Perfect unison, major second, minor second, major third, minor third, perfect fourth, augmented fourth, or triton, see, that's the, you know, in the, in the Middle Ages, that interval was known as the Diabolus in Musica, the devil in music, because it had this very jarring sound, you know, very important interval. Perfect four, perfect fifth, diminished fifth, which is your triton. Now, major six, six minor six, Major seventh, very dissonant interval, and minor seventh. 